Hi friends, I'm Lisa Roberry. And I'm Sean Roberry. And we're your independent Sensi consultants. It is that time again for some first sniffs. So you know I have to have my partner in crime here to do some first sniffs together. You right. know we are both very honest in what we are feeling and what we are smelling and our tastes are totally different. <laughs> A lot of you have actually commented and say, actually, I feel like my scent preferences align more with Sean yeah. <laughs> than yours. And then there's some of us who are like me and you like the way other things smell. Yeah. So we actually have two collections that we are going to be sniffing through today. We have the holiday collection as well as the Bre breast cancer awareness collection that is, they're both launching on October 1st, 2023. As always, we are accepting pre-orders. So if you would like to be added to our order list, um, feel free to fill out the order form that is linked down below. That order form is jam packed full of stuff. We've got the <laughs> yes, it is. I should know I made it. <laughs> he put it together. <laughs> yeah. uh, we've got the scent warmer of the month. We've got the holiday collection, which is jam packed. We've got the breast cancer awareness collection. There's all kinds of stuff. So definitely check out the order form and we will get you taken care of. And anything else that you want that is in the catalog that's not on there, just list it and we'll get you taken care of as well. Yeah. There's no need to pay additional shipping fees. Yeah. Just pay the one just shipping the one. fee yeah. and then we'll get you taken care of. So, no problem. All right. So you're the boss. Where are we starting? Uh, we're going to start in the holiday collection. Oh, the holiday collection. Now there is a lot more than just bars in this collection. So I will run kind of when we're done with our sniff session, we'll kind of like do a little overview and talk about what's going to be in this collection. But I'll also run pictures at the end of this video of both the uh, breast cancer awareness collection as well as the holiday collection. So you can see everything in its entirety. Yeah, A lot of cool warmers in the holiday. Collection. Super cool. Yeah, a yeah. Lot, of, lot of options, a lot of new ones. Uh, yeah, very cool. Love it. Very cool. All right, uh, let's get so, started. Oh yeah, it comes with the bag. With, with the holiday collection bars, you do get this cute little bag. I love that Sensi has started doing this this year with these um, with these bars. They're like, hey, have a cute little bag along with it. So I love this. So there are five bars in this collection. They all sound absolutely amazing. And these are legit first sniffs. I have not had a chance to smell them yet. Um, and neither has Sean. No. So. Nope. It was really hard to like have them sitting in the box for a couple of weeks. <laughs> and I have not, I have not touched them. I just opened the box. There we go. <sighs> are you ready? There we go. All right. What are, what are we starting with? We're going to start with Sleigh Ride. Sleigh Ride. Okay. Sleigh great. Ride. So Sleigh Ride is a beautiful green wax. Yeah, let's, hopefully I get all the names out correctly, but it's been <laughs> it was hilarious after the last one. The Free Fallen. The, uh, the Tom Petty stuff, all the comments like, on the order forms or just people commenting on the video and stuff, just absolutely hilarious. We even had a friend, didn't she say, she sent you a message and said that when she was going through the grocery store or oh, something yeah, yeah, that yeah, Tom the, Petty came on? Yeah, <laughs> let's take it to the video. Hilarious, completely by mistake, but it was a lot of fun. Yeah. All right, okay. um, first one, sleigh ride. Sleigh ride. Sleigh ride. Here we go, ready, go. Oh, this is nice. Christmas. This is nice. This is like, this is a sister to very snowy spruce. Mm -hmm. Did you warm it up with your finger? I did not. You should warm it up with your finger. Okay. <laughs> He's not. Ah. It's good. There is a sweetness to this, but it's definitely Christmas tree. I would say the difference between the two, it's hard because I'm not smelling them side by side, but this one has a little more woodsy elements to this that snow, very snowy spruce does not have, but this has the same kind of sweetness. It's a sister. They're not even cousins. They're just, they're sisters. Oh, that's really nice. Sleigh ride. It's like I was back in Stanley, Idaho. Oh, you love Stanley, yeah, Idaho. He just got it. done camping. Yeah, it was really nice. Okay, where are we going next? Uh, next is Oh, good. I should read the description. I'm yeah, sorry yeah. for interrupting. That's okay. You probably should. Yeah, okay. Okay, uh, let's see here. Sleigh Ride is described as crisp air, fallen fur needle, tart cranberry. So there's cranberry in here. I love cranberry. This time of year. I love cranberry all times of the year. Okay. Nice. Where are we going now? Uh, it's going to be a cranberry a candy cane. Cranberry? You love cranberry. I love cranberry. <laughs> so cranberry candy cane, beautiful red wax. Ready? Well, that's a strong one. That's, a, that's not that, that's pretty decent. I was worried about the candy cane. Yeah. Oh, no. 
Did you say oh no? Uh, Did you yeah. just say oh no? <laughs> well yeah, I got a different sniff of it. This, I don't pick up cranberry. Yeah, the candy cane's on the bottom. Candy cane, but it smells like wax. Like I know, I know you're probably like, Lisa, it is wax. But it smells like wax, like just like, yeah. I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna be totally honest. This smells like a really cheap peppermint wax. I'm sorry, it does. I, d I don't, what is up with this? I'm sorry, if you love this, <laughs> I'm not, this just, it's just not what I was expecting. Hmm. And this is just my nose, by the way. He's, yeah, he's I don't think that's gonna he's sell like, any of these. He's, I'm, I wanna be honest, no, it's, you know what I think, I, I would love to actually mix this with candy cane, candy cane buttercream. Hmm. Um, because I think for some people, candy cane buttercream is too sweet with that vanilla bean buttercream base. This is more peppermint. So I think mixing the two will be really nice, but this is not what I was expecting. Hmm. Okay. Let me go ahead and read the description because it is not going to be what I just told you. <laughs> okay. Um, candy, candy, cramp. <laughs> <laughs> We're struggling here already. Okay. Week. Cranberry candy cane is described as fresh cranberries, peppermint sticks, pomegranate. Maybe the pomegranate in here is what's making it weird for me, but I don't really smell cranberries either. Mm -mm. Hmm. Hmm. The huh. verdict is out on that one. Okay. All right. Next is going to be vanilla barnwood. Vanilla barnwood. I love vanilla scents. And this is the really pretty like cream color. Okay. Fingers crossed. <laughs> there you go. Ah, yes. This, this is nice. Warm it up. This is really nice. I love this and this is great for my friends who like vanilla scents but don't like bakery vanilla scents. Yeah. That, um, sometimes bakery great... sometimes bakery vanillas can smell too, like buttery almost. I'm here for it. But some people are like I I smell like butter. Um, this is definitely a true vanilla scent with with a woodsy note to it. Mm. That makes sense by saying like it's not a bakery vanilla? Yeah. Yep. This is really, this is a, this is going to be a bedroom scent. That's really nice. This is a everywhere scent. This is, I, I love vanilla scents. They're yeah. like my favorite. Year round, <laughs> everywhere. I love this. Oh man, that's, <laughs> that, that is nice. That is really In our club already. It's about to be. <laughs> it's not available yet. You can't add it to club yet. You can add it to your club though on October 1st and you should because this one, this is a keeper. Okay. Oh, that's why. I know why. Cause there's amber in this and yeah. I love amber. Awesome. Awesome. So this is vanilla barnwood and this is described as, or the notes are vanilla, amber, and barnwood. That's really nice. This is awesome. Yeah. <sighs> mm, Very nice. Keeper. Okay. Things are turning around. Here we go. <clears throat> Which one? Oh, okay. uh, rum, a rum, plum. <laughs> rum, plum, plum. <laughs> <laughs> or however that is, is uh, a song, right? Is it? <laughs> it, it still is a song actually. <laughs> Or something. <laughs> okay, right, are you ready? Okay, so we've got rum plum plum. All right, here we go. I think... Oh, that's nice. You don't like I don't this. think so. <laughs> I don't think so. This is really nice. I feel like if you missed out on Maleficent, uh, Mistress of Evil, is it? Mis yeah, Mistress of Evil, the, the purple one. This is similar, not exactly the same, but I feel like it will check those boxes for you. This is really nice. Hmm. I love this. I, I'd be willing to throw and give it a on a flyer and have it warm and see how it turns out. Mm. I think this is going to be really nice. This is not bakery. This is definitely fruity. So um, if you're wanting that like more like bakery fruity kind of scent, this is not it. This is all fruity. But it's really nice. If you wanted to add like a bakery note to this, you can add some vanilla bean buttercream, that type of thing in here. So, okay. <clears throat> Rum plum plum is plum jam, vanilla sugar, and flaky buttery crust. It's funny because they say that this is a bakery scent, that there's like a buttery crust. I don't get the buttery crust note in this. It's more fruity. Do you, do you agree? There's no like... It's just an interesting... It's just interesting. Interesting. I, th I think it's a good plum scent, but I don't get, I don't get the bakery. 
But that may come blown. out. That may come out when blown, it's blown, warming. Blown. That may come out when it's warming. So we'll see. Okay. All right. Lastly, I think I'm most intrigued by this one. Yeah, that's why I did it last. Cherry, excuse me, cherries jubilee. Cherries jubilee. Really pretty red wax. Oh, okay, I am really excited for this. Okay, are you ready? <clears throat> oh, that's nice. Oh yeah, that's nice. Took a little second, but we got there. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Wow. <laughs> there it is. If yeah, you, if it you, is all on the bottom. If oh. you don't like cherry scents, that you're not gonna like this. This really is all cherry. Cherry, yeah. It's all cherry, but I feel like it's done well. This is a great, th this reminds me of, what are those, what are those drops that yeah. are actually? The, the candies yeah. for the kids back in. Back in, in our day? Yeah, uh, was it Luden's or something? Luden's, yeah, or where it, 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 they're cough drops, but they're, it's cherry candy. Yeah, yeah only take medicine when uh, you're supposed to and correctly. They were candy. They were candy. They were <laughs> Okay, so cherries, <clears throat> cherries jubilee. Let's see what we have here. Cherries jubilee is black cherry, raspberry, and zesty lemon. So I think there is, I think I do pick up that lemon just a little bit, which is why I feel like it kind of cuts the sweetness for me. Cause sometimes, a lot of times, if it's just like a, just pure cherry scent, a lot of times it's just a little too much for me. We had, um, you aren't gonna remember this, but we had for Bring Back My Bar, wild black cherry. Oh yeah, like yeah, yeah. No, do you, that. for reals, do you remember? No. no. <laughs> um, it was really, really strong. And you were like, it was one of those where you were like, can we turn some of these warmers off because this is just too much. Yeah. Um, it was really strong, it was really, really sweet. Um, but I think the lemon and, what? Nothing. Uh -huh. Is that like an everyday thing or something? No, I was just, I, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised that my nose is playing along because <laughs> just uh, like a half hour ago, I was walking around and it, I said it smelled like a wet, cat food in the house and i don't know what it was i i don't smell the wet cat food we have salted caramel toffee that's melting in here and and you like that you, yeah. and you said it's not out here that it smells yeah, it's like down. it it's going down the hall we don't have cats yeah anyway yeah to be okay. here you had to be here anyways cherry cherries jubilee i think <clears throat> this is great i think the lemon that is in this it's not overpowering like i honestly didn't even recognize that it was in there until until seeing the description but I do feel like it. There is something in here that does cut the sweetness just a little bit, just enough. So, cherries jubilee. Okay, we have to rate these. Are those how you're rating them? Yes, ma'am. Did we rate the same? No, we didn't. Okay, so is this your number one? Yeah. Okay, so both of our because at what we like to do is with each collection we like to rate them from the ones we like the most to the least, and a lot of times we're different, but. We're starting off the same. Cherry's Jubilee, number one. I really like this. Ah, okay. Number two. Vanilla. Vanilla Barnwood, both of them. Number one and number two were synced nice. up. Oh, so good. So, so nice. Sleigh. Number three. Sleigh ride. Sleigh ride for him. Number three, <clears throat> excuse me, number three for me is Rum Plum Plum. Plum Plum. Rum, rum Plum Plum. <laughs> Try to say this five times fast. I dare you. There's only one L. Rum pum plum. Rum pum plum. Plum me plum plum. <laughs> number three for me. Which means number four for you is Barumpa Pum Pum. <laughs> <laughs> and number four for me is Sleigh Ride. And what we can definitely agree on is number five being uh, cranberry candy cane. Hmm. I don't know, man. There's something that's just kind of wonky for me on this one but it, it could just be my nose but there's that so that is the holiday collection of bars just the bars specifically it does come with this super cute little um little pouch there but the collection is so much more than just bars um we also have some warmers um again i will run these warmers at the end the pictures and stuff at the end of this video but we've got um, a brand new snowed in warmer which is um a cute little house with some snow on it um the christmas camper for my friends who loved the christmas camper that one is back as a mini warmer super cute um known for the holidays is back as a mini warmer pine for plaid <laughs> no that the camper i want to see it when it comes in because that might be a 
like a shin hazard. <laughs> it might be, yeah, I would say. It, it's a pretty good size. So, <laughs> so as a mini warmer. Be mindful warmer, where you put it. Where you're, like, make sure it's like up higher than, yeah. Especially in this house, the way I'm running into things and falling and whatnot, yeah. it, it would be dangerous. Uh, pine for plaid mini warmers also coming back. We have the retro reindeer warmer. We have jolly old Saint Nick. We've got these super cute both full size and uh, mini snowman warmers. And you actually said you actually really liked these. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and it's called snow cute. Like the set. Like the set. I like things to match would be a set. Yes. So he's a big fan. Uh, we also have the gingerbread man tabletop fan diffuser. Super fun. Um, also some licensed goodies, of course, in this collection. Uh, we have the Christmas with Disney, Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse Scentsy Warmer in this cute little sleigh. Um, we have the Santa Disney Stitch Scentsy Buddy, adorable, which also means the Experiment 626 is also making a return in the bar as well as the scent pack. Um, we also have a new premium fan, uh, sorry, premium diffuser shade, Noble and Bright, and some other warmers and, and good stuff there. So you'll definitely see, like I said, all of them all run at the end of this video. We also have, um, I saw this, I saw this and I asked and I was like, please tell me they brought Tinselberry back in the wax. They did not bring Tinselberry back in the wax, but if you're missing it, it will be available as a hand soap as well as a hand cream. So good. Uh, Snow Kiss Cranberry in the counter clean. And then we also have Arctic Kiss in the laundry line, you guys. So, <clears throat> so the laundry um, liquid as well as washer whiffs and then Scentsy Fresh as well. And, and, then, yep. and last but most certainly not least on the on the back here, the Radiant Red Poinsettia Fragrance Flowers, $16 each. These will be available in Cranberry, Candy Cane, Sleigh Ride, and Vanilla Barnwood fragrances. Uh, vanilla Barnwood. Yeah, is you're going to want yeah. Vanilla Barnwood in that. You are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they've been doing phenomenal work with these fragrance flowers since when they first came out. Like so many new options. Yeah. So very cool. I love it. So there we have it. So now let's talk about the breast cancer awareness collection. This collection will include a warmer. This collection will include a buddy. We also now have pink just for this collection, pink light bulbs, you guys pink. So 15 Watts, 20 Watts and 25 Watts. Um, we will also have, um, a positively pink buttercup bell fragrance flower course it'll be pink and then we also have a four pack of scent circles each purchase there will be a different amount donated um to the breast cancer foundation so and then we also have the bars of course yes so and that is right here, right here. so we have the pink awareness um Scentsy bar four pack yes we have not smelled these so we're gonna do this here together right, right now right here right now Okay, <laughs> and it will come in this little box too. So, okay. So the scents are I Pink I Can, Pink Spreads Hope, Positively Pink, and Turn Up the Pink. Sean was saying when he was putting together the order form, he's like, all these scents sound so good. <laughs> so if your fragrance preferences line up with Sean's, listen up because it sounds like these are the bars that he's going to prefer. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank so you. what do we, we're going to start with, Oh, we're going from lightest to darkest. That's why I did that. No, that's not why he no. did that. <laughs> okay. What are we starting with? Uh, first one is turn up the pink, turn up the pink. This is the, you're not, you're not going to see any of this. This I feel like cause the lighting is super warm and these are all pink. So it's all going to look the same. Turn up the pink. There it is. Okay. Turn up the pink. Don't cheat. You're cheating. You're I'm looking not. at the description. That's okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> okay. Ready? Here we go. Oh, this is so pretty. If you like floral. Yeah. It, but it's, it's a sweet floral, but I feel like if you like sugar, I feel like this is similar to sugar. Sugar hasn't been around for a minute, you guys. Oh, this is really pretty. This this smells a lot like sugar. I think it's gonna be a, a light <sighs> performer. So yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, this there's only one way to find out. I know, we gotta warm it. 
Okay, so Turn Up the Pink is, th that's what we're smelling, right? Turn Up the Pink yep. is Sparkling Citrus, Gardenia Blossom, and Rosewood. Mm -hmm. I'm super interested because, or I think this is interesting, because typically gardenia scents are very powdery. This doesn't smell powdery to me. This is more of a sweet floral to my nose. That's what I was getting was the powder. Really? The beginning. Yeah. How funny. Yeah. Yeah, I don't smell powder. This smells like sugar to me. The, the scent sugar, not like sugar cane, but the scent sugar. Like Aqualina's pink sugar. Okay. <laughs> All right, what's next? Uh, next is Pink Spreads Hope. Pink Spreads Hope. Okay. <sighs> there you go. Pink. That's powder. That's powder. <laughs> I feel like there's probably rose in this. Maybe. The, it's powdery. That is very powdery. Okay. Pink spread. So if, for my floral lovers, Linda's going to love this. <laughs> yeah, <just>. Grandma, <laughs> um, is that you? No, would you stop <laughs> it? <laughs> no, we've got, we've, we've got some friends that love floral scents. This is going to be totally up her alley. Um, okay. So pink spreads hope is described as pink grapefruit, pink grapefruit rose. Is that a thing? Oh uh -oh. man. Hold on friends. Okay. Pink parfait rose. Oh, pink. I said, did I say grapefruit? <laughs> I need my glasses. Yeah. Okay, pink parfait rose, violet, and leafy greens. I would agree with that because it, it's, I, I smelled the rose right off the bat. Yeah. There is like, it's not, this doesn't smell like simply rose or anything. Like it's not all rose. Like you definitely pick up those other floral elements, but it's definitely floral. And if you like those more like floral, floral scents, more powdery floral scents, You'll love this. This is it. This is it for you. Okay, pink spreads hope. Okay. Nice. Next one. Is I pink, I can. I pink, I can. Hot pink. I love it. So hot pink. Ready? There you go. Okay. Yeah. There's more citrus in this. Yeah. Yeah. This might be, this might be grapefruit. Is there grapefruit in this? Let's see. I pink, I, I pink, I can. I pink, I can. Tropical stone fruit. Yeah. That's nice. This is really nice. That this is, is really this nice. is nice. This is more of a summery scent. So for my friends who like fruity, summery, tropical kind of scents, I think you'll really love this. Club it. You'll love it in the yes, summertime. That is very good. I pink I can is coconut water, tropical stone fruit, hibiscus nectar. So good. I love that. Okay. Next one. Nice. Lastly. Lastly. Positively pink. Positively pink. The darkest of the bunch. <clears throat> Last one. There we go. Ready to go. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love this. You know what this smells like? This smells like, does it smell like, does it smell familiar? It's okay if it doesn't. Yeah, we were just warming it. No, we weren't. <laughs> this is first sniff. Hocus Pocus. This smells like Hocus Pocus. There's a, there's a dark cherry note in here. Th this smells like Hocus Pocus. If you missed out on Hocus Pocus, this isn't like exactly, but man, this is pretty darn close. Yeah. If you missed out on adding Hocus Pocus, uh, Sanders, perfectly wicked, Sanderson sisters, perfectly wicked, whatever it is, you're going to love this. Oh, heck yes. Okay. There's no cherry in this, but positively pink is raspberry vanilla sandalwood. It smells so similar to Hocus Pocus, you guys. Like I said, not exactly, but again, I feel like this will check those boxes for you. Oh, I love this. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. How are you going to rate yours? Yeah. Uh, coming in number one, my favorite of the bunch. I pink I can. <laughs> I pink I can. My number one is positively pink. You already know if it smells like Sanderson Sisters, and it does. It just it's giving me Sanderson Sisters vibes. Number two for me is gonna be turn up for what? <laughs> turn up the pink. <laughs> Wait for that beat to drop. Yeah, number two for me is I pink I can. Mm -hmm. mm. Yep. Mm. Mm. Get you some of that. Mm. Positively pink, number three. Number three for me is turn up the pink. So we were just kind of a little flip flopped here, but the last one <laughs> is the same. It is the same. That would be the pink spreads hope. Pink spreads hope for our floral lovers. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
There, there you is. have it. So <laughs> that is the that is the uh, pink awareness bar bundle that will be available on October 1st, along with everything else from the breast cancer awareness collection, along with everything from the holiday collection. So much good stuff coming in October, you guys. We also have the Dumbo collection that's going to be launching in October sometime holiday bricks that are going to be launching in October sometime, um, which you will look forward to uh, those first sniffs together for those goodies as well. So there you have it. Thank you, sir, for lending your sniffer. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. Again, if you would like to be added to our order list, I will link the order form down below in the description. You do not have to be local to us in order for us to place the order for you. We place it, we place the order for you and it's shipped directly to your door. So if you are going to place your order on your own, you can go onto our website, which is rowberrywax.com, or you can go onto your consultant's website and all of this will be available October 1st. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like this type of content. If you like the first sniffs with my man here. <laughs> uh, if you're new, please subscribe. If you already subscribed, be sure to hit the notification bell. That way you stay up to date with all things Scentsy. Have an amazing day, you guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye, Bye. guys. See ya.